PLC programmers are in trouble. At least that's what they are saying. A lot of people believe AI is replacing us. Factories don't need PLC programmers anymore. Automation jobs are disappearing. And to be honest, if you are doing traditional PLC programming, it is hard to argue against this. But is it whole story or there is something people are missing? Let's talk about that in today's video. The first part of the video contain what are the people fears. In second half of the video, we are going to talk about what are my opinions on all these points. Before we go ahead and talk further about today's video, if you are new to the channel, consider subscribing. Turn your notification on if you don't want to miss our future content related to PLC, DCS, SCADA, Industrial IoT, Cybersecurity, AI and different amazing future trend technologies. If you are a PLC programmer, you might hear these kind of a thoughts. AI and low code platforms are taking over. AI powered tools can write the code easily and companies are preferring low code or no code automation platforms. Now let's talk about the second point. Factories need more than just a PLC programming. It's not all about right now knowing STL, ladder logic or FPD. Employees expect the knowledge of SCADA, industrial IoT, cybersecurity, data science, data analytics and different industrial protocols. If it is just the ladder logic that you know, then you are in real danger. Job security is getting worse. In current days, outsourcing trend is on rise when we talk about PLC related jobs. Either they will go for hiring some remote engineer, reducing the need of a full-time employment or a permanent employment. Freelance engineers are easily available and they can do your project as a freelance role. And most of the companies are choosing freelance engineers nowadays because we got a, we got PLC, competitive PLC engineers available worldwide in different countries. They can help you in a lesser cost as compared to a full time employer. And there are a lot of PLC freelance related jobs at the moment. But when it comes to permanent roles, it is very hard to find out PLC engineers permanent roles these days. I hear many people saying that I've been in this field for more than decade, more than 10 years, but their salary is slightly increased, not a major jump into the salary compared to other fields. New systems, new PLC systems are way more complex. It is very hard to troubleshoot them. Cybersecurity risks are adding additional pressure. Yeah, these struggles are real. But is there any room still available for PLC engineer? Let's find out. Now I'm going to be talking about my perspective about all these rumors. AI is replacing us. My understanding is that AI is not replacing PLC engineers. It is going to create new opportunities. AI can write logic, but it cannot design the control system. It cannot troubleshoot real world scenarios. And it cannot obviously handle plant-wide integration. My understanding is different. AI can be used as a weapon. But if you close your eyes and, and don't use AI, obviously that would be used against you. Those people who use AI to do the job, they would definitely excel way faster than those who are on the mindset that AI is against us and we are not going to be using it. So it's going to be very important that you, you utilize AI instead of that AI start taking over your job. New technologies obviously are very important. If you talk about industrial digitalization, data science, machine learning, AI, these all concepts are really very important. And when we talk about nowadays, cybersecurity is one of very important topic. Instead of getting feared about enhancements, it's better to understand these topics. It's better to understand industrial protocols. It's better to understand industrial digitalization, how you integrate different systems. Rather than being worried about it, it's important that you grab the skills which are in demand, which are required. You need to accept the challenge rather than closing your eyes and accept your failure. Your job security actually depends on your adoptability. If you wanted to be a traditional PLC programmer, I would suggest not to do that. If you are willing to learn more and you're curious to know about latest trends, 
then that is very important and good feel for you. So in short, industry is not dying. It is evolving. If you like this video, consider hitting the like button. Subscribe if you haven't yet. Until next, until next time, take care and bye-bye.